From Jet 24, here's meteorologist Craig Flynn, your weather authority. And good evening, and the picture, well, tells the story here. A lot of clear sky sunshine on the U.S. netting cam as we look over downtown and State Street. So expect a clear sky tonight overall, fairly pleasant night. But we're dodging the raindrops, man. So this is September. The last 12 days, nothing, no rain has fallen from the sky. And of the 25 days that we've been through this month, only two had had measurable rain and I, and I don't really count a trace of rain there were a few days where we had a trace you can't really count that uh, I'm talking about in the bucket so uh, yeah no doubt about it it's been a dry month so here's how it stacks up uh, because well we're in a deficit now this month behind the eight ball by three inches and for the year we're four inches behind schedule so I know the weather's going to be great this weekend, but we really do need some rain, and I think we're going to get it as we head into next week. So 77 right now in the city of Erie, 75 uh, in Meadville. Let's talk about what's going on. Satellite radar again, system down to the south, moving away. High pressure anchored out uh, and extends all the way through the Great Lakes, and that's going to provide us with a good deal of clear sky tonight. Temperatures only drop into the low uh, 60s and as we take you on future cast here and through the overnight hours again expect a mainly clear sky and then we go into Saturday southwesterly winds will continue uh, and that will bring in temperatures at or over 80 yet again for the day tomorrow so we hit 80 today I think we're going to add a couple few degrees to that number coming up tomorrow with a good deal of sunshine and the whole everything you know when, when we look at the overall weather pattern everything's really slowing down so even into Sunday, a broad southwest wind continues. The record high for Sunday is 85. We have an opportunity to tie that record on Sunday. Keep in mind, a normal high is only like 68 or 69. So that just kind of speaks to how unseasonably warm it will be this weekend. This front, really not much guts to it. Watch how it just kind of washes out. Uh, and uh, stays off to the west of us. So even into Monday, we've slowed things down and we've kept Monday. Uh, dry for the most part. This is the cold front though right here that comes through on Tuesday. This one has some teeth to it. So expect temperatures to start to tumble as we get into mid and late next week. Here it is though this weekend sunshine 82. Sunday breezy unseasonably warm a bit humid too. A high temperature of 85. If we hit 85 that would tie the record for the date. Then we look down the road into next week, and again, with the weather pattern slowing down, this doesn't look like it's going to arrive and move in here until like mid or late week as the jet stream dips. Much cooler, just in time for October. Jet pinpoint for the lakeshore then tonight. Expect a clear sky, pleasant night. The moon, Saturn will be out, and Jupiter as well, 59 to 64. Areas south of I-90. A mainly clear sky could be some patchy fog, lows 54 to 59. And for the Chautauqua Allegheny region, clear, comfortable night, low temperatures 49 to 54. Down the road we go with the seven day forecast, so more sunshine and more like summer. Saturday, 82. Near record warmth Sunday, windy, dry, high of 85. Just a spotty storm on Monday upper 70s to near 80 and then we get into Tuesday with the showers and thunderstorms as the cold front comes through a gusty wind and then as we roll into October right on cue high temperatures only in the 50s it'll be blustery it'll be showery at times as we head into the second half of the week your eerie.com click on weather for the latest updated forecast check out the weather cams and the interactive radar there as well Jill over to you thank you